Welcome to Awesome Physio YouTube channel. The following video is going to be looking at the best core exercises to strengthen through the lower back and around the core. What this creates is a corset of support for anybody suffering either post disc injury or with chronic lower back pain. So we're going to be going through the stages of activating the core today from complete beginner to a bit more advanced. We're gonna build it up nice and gently. So the first exercise that I absolutely love for activating the core and just seeing how much core stability is within the body is lifting up into a bridge position. So you gently wanna lift up through the bum, lifting up into the air, holding for a couple of seconds, squeezing into the glutes and then relaxing back down. So of course you're using the glutes through this exercise, but you're looking to see how stable the body is when you lift it up into the air. So as you're lifting it up, you're looking for that strong base, holding at the top, and then relaxing back down. You'd want to aim to do this lovely slow and controlled about 10 to 15 times. So the second core exercise that I absolutely love is a variation of the dead bug. So it's kind of the beginner before the advanced dead bug. So how we do this is we have the hands down by the side. We're gonna gently lift the legs up into the air at 90 degrees. The key part of this exercise and core activation is making sure there's no hyperextension into the lower back. So everything is tucked down and fixed down towards the floor. To start off with, so very, very beginner, we want to start to just gently let one leg drop forward and then bring it back up to the middle. So you should feel it in the core and in the tummy. It should be lovely and controlled that you're not letting that extend as you come down. And then what you can build over time, which I really like, is the amount of distance that you move with the leg as well as fixing here. So over time, you can start to bring the leg a lot straighter and a lot lower as well as fixing through that lower spine. What you then do is alternate through the other leg. Good. So you want to aim between 10 to 15 reps on each leg. So the next exercise is the actual dead bug. So how the dead bug should look. So again, same as before, you want to bring both legs up to 90 degrees, but this time you're using the upper body as well. So that is up in the air with the arms straight. Again, making sure we're not overextending through that lower spine, so we're dropping it down towards the floor. We want to alternate the arm and the leg in a different direction. So we're going to drop the leg forward and bring the arm above the head. And then back to the middle. So the distance by which you drop the leg forward and let the arm rise above the head is determined by how strong you feel within the core making sure you're fixing the whole time. So again, same the other side. So my final favourite core exercise is the good old fashioned plank. However, I feel it's really important to build up to this lovely and slowly. So what I recommend patients do, and what I think is really helpful building up that core, is to start in the plank position on your knees and intimate between knees and a full plank. So you're building up lovely and gently. So we want to go on to the knees, into this position. We're going to drop down as if we're going into a plank. What we're then going to do is gently bring the legs back and hold. 